Sycamores will have the football, and they've got a 7-0 lead early on here in normal. And they'll try Dinka again. This time he works the left side, and he goes, cuts up the middle, and he's going to be real close to a first down as he ripped off about a 7 or 8. It's like a blitz coming off the edge here. Gerhardt. First down, it's Dinka, and he has a nice run across midfield. Dylan Gerhardt got him from behind. First and 10 from their 30-yard line. Anikstead flips it out, coming back to get it is Sopkowitz, and he made the play right in front of the 7. Anikstead over the middle, has his man, and he has a first down. Sopkowitz ran a route right at the sticks, made the play. And the Redbirds are going to throw it again. This time it's Jalen Carr who makes the catch. And Illinois State is inside Indiana State. Five receivers in this set here with no running back. And they're going to go to Cam Grandy who makes the catch and runs through a guy before he's finally brought down. Jeff Brown, fourth and sixth. The Redbirds are six of nine on fourth down conversions this year. They go over the middle, wide Touchdown. open is Jalen Carr. Touchdown. What a call. What a call. Indiana State. I was expecting maybe a blitz, but they went the opposite. But Zach here, they drop eight player, an extra defender. And unfortunately for them, they have Garrett. And Carr goes in motion. And, the man. and Mueller dives ahead. He's got that first down. He wasn't really touched until he'd already and reached Mueller the marker. So area. good. Oh, that's, that's offsides on Indiana State. No flag at this point. Sopkowitz is going to come back and make the catch. Wow. And the Redbirds have. A fresh set of downs. First and ten now. All kinds of time for Anikstad, and now he's got a lot of room to run. Anikstad all the way inside the... Instead, it's second and ten, and now a little pitch out. This is Blakemore. Tries to get to the edge. Gets a nice block from Grandy, and is angled out of bounds inside the ten. From the five. Anikstad pressured, wrapped up, and now he lost the football. It's on the floor, or on the uh, field, but it was Jake Pope. Ian Wagner to try a 30-yard field goal, and his kick is good, so he's three out of three from the season. That was Illinois State at 25-yard line. A little play action. And now the ball is out again. It's still free, and it's finally jumped on that time. It is. Redbirds again show pressure. They screen it out. This is Caton, and he's pushed out of bounds at about the seven, and so the Redbirds start at their 45-yard line on first down, and Anikstad is going to pitch it out to Blakemore, who avoids one tackle. He's got a first down. He's still on his feet, and he avoids a second. Defensive line, Indiana State. Anikstad, deep ball, looks for Sobkowitz, and it's Ooh. incomplete. Excellent coverage. Stride for. It's like they're only sending three. Anikstead's going to scramble, and Anikstead's going to keep it. He's going to get close. He got, he got a nice going to get a lot of high fives for that block, and now Blakemore gets the carry Ooh. this time, and he dances around a would-be tackler and dives ahead inside the 20. In coverage. Nobody moved with the tight end. Anikstead's pass is caught. It looks like Grandy has enough for an Illinois State. Great job. So it is first down, and now Blakemore bounces to the outside and turns the corner, and it's in the end zone for an Illinois State. Here. Uh, okay, 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 okay. Nope. You don't got broken tackle. I'm just faster than you are. Runs to the end zone. And State, Cade Chambers has his offense out at the 25 yard line. He's going to flip it out. This is Caton. And a nice pickup of about seven on the play. Yeah, nice. Less than a yard now for the Sycamores. Dinka gets that first down. And that's the first time this afternoon that Indiana State has converted on third down. Chambers is going to keep it. He's chased from behind. Keandre Jackson. Jackson. Wow. Line of Indiana State here. Just under a minute to go in the half. This is going to be Jalen Carr who makes the catch, and he's angled out of bounds. It'll stop that clock. Here. Now try running it with Mueller, and he's got the first down still on his feet to the 30-yard line. So the Redbirds cash in on that third down, and that's another Illinois State to the line of scrimmage on first down. And Anikstead again over the middle. It's Grandy, and he is inside oh, wow. the 15 down, down to the 10-yard line. Second and 10 now for the Redbirds. Anikstead's going to keep it and flip it, oh, wow. and it's going to be a Cam Grandy, Grandy touchdown. What a that play design. They worked on that one in practice, and it worked out. Look Perfect. here, you know, post football. You look at this. 
Nice catch, nice finish. I mean, for, for as big as he is, this guy moves well. Here in normal so far. First run of the second half is Dinky's changing uh, his direction, and that's going to be an excellent decision because he just picked up possession of the third quarter. Flip it out to the tight end that time, and there's going to be some yards here. He's got some blocking before he's finally pushed out of bounds. And on first down, they're going to try the other side of the field. This is Caton. Goes one-on-one -on -one with Gearhart, who bumps him out of six of nine for 56 yards. The give is a first down carry. That's Plez Lawrence who came in and got a nice run, probably his best. Of pressure coming from Kneecamp. And a nice run. Lawrence gets through it as he worked the right side cannon, goes over to stop it as the Sycamores have an effective first drive of the second half. They're going to flip it out to Dinka. He's going to angle himself towards the marker, but it looks like he's bumped out just shot. Face a third and six. And this time they go to Grandy. Can he get to the first down marker? He dives ahead. Man. And Cam Grandy. Second and ten. The Redbirds are going to try it on the ground. This is Blakemore. He had a big hole up the middle, and he dives ahead across the 35-yard line, and the Redbirds will face third and short. So it's third and two. And this time it's Anikstead. Oh, and Anikstead around the end. One man to beat. He's going to be pushed out of oh, bounds. Blitz. Anikstead over the middle. Sopkowitz. Is he in? He is. I think he's in. What a play by Sopkowitz. But... It, go, it starts there. And it's a 12-yarder from Zach Anikstead. And Wagner boots the extra point through, and the Redbirds have now scored. Chambers with pressure again. He throws, and he's got a receiver for a first down. If he made the catch, and they're saying yes. Under four minutes to go here, third quarter. Chambers being chased. Amir Abdullah gets him again. His second sack of the afternoon. And down in 19 yards to go from their 35-yard line. They're going to try Dinka, and he's got a big hole as he works the left side, and he busts out near midfield, so that's a big pickup for the Sikkim. Out now, and it's first and 10 for Indiana State, and Chambers pump fakes and then throws, and is picked off. Intercepted by the Redbird defense. And Anikstead to the end zone, incomplete, flag coming in. He was. You do got Mueller in the backfield. And Anikstead lobs it, Javon Charles, touchdown Red. Get the football. This is a very popular play for my broadcast partner. He likes the little four for the birds. First touchdown of the season for Javon Charles on his third catch of the year. They're in control of this one, 13-11 to play, 37 Chambers is going to try to screen it oh, out. Wow. Intercepted. A pick six for Illinois State's Keandre. Andre Jackson. With the, we have a flag on the play. I don't think all it's over the field making plays, and then he gets a touchdown. Interception return for a touchdown. It's here in the second half. The field, and so the Redbirds are going in this case to their third string running back in Robinson. This time Rittenhouse is going to keep it and he's got another Illinois State Redbird Toyota first down as he carries it with a first down at its own 30-yard line. Robinson with the carry across the 30 to about the 33-yard line. Holly game here today. Pick up a three so it's now second and seven. Rittenhouse is going to keep off after the nice fake on Robinson and he dives ahead to about the from the Illinois State 15. Big hole up the middle. Wow. Nice run, Illinois State. Play a gain of seven for Robinson on the play, so it's second and three. Rittenhouse is going to flip the ball out, and that's going to be another first down. That ball was caught Scotty. in space out there. Quality reps coming in now for some of these second and or third team guys. This time the running play is stuffed. That Robinson had no place to go there. Yeah, yeah. Comeback performance after a tough loss. It's Robinson out near midfield before he's submarined down. Series now at quarterback. Looks like the Sycamores are content to kind of keep the ball on the ground. Gonna run it up the middle here. Yeah. Third yard receiving game here. No, but. By an it, opponent. Yeah. Yeah, well. But it was a victory, I think, for your team. It was a victory uh, for on, the on Missouri State Bears. Uh, interception return, Garrett Olendike returned a tipped pass. 
and uh, ran it back for a score. That ball is on the turf. That should be it. And that's going to wind up being on the season to four and two and two and one in the Missouri Valley Conference. And Indiana State will slip to 0 and six overall and 0 and Illinois State just getting it done on both the offensive and the defensive end. 416 total yards and 244 of them on the ground, as we mentioned.